The standardized test scores released today show Rhode Island students are getting better at science, but only about one third are actually meeting expectations. Eyewitness News reporter Stephen Schuler is covering schools from Bristol now. Overall, science test scores are improving in Rhode Island. Still, the education commissioner tells me the results are alarming. From biology to chemistry, nearly one in three Rhode Island students are considered proficient in science. State education officials released the NECAP test results Wednesday morning, showing students improved by 3% over last year. We think that our overall results are still alarmingly low at the, in science, but we have to take a moment to celebrate these kinds of gains because we are making tremendous progress across the state at all levels. Take a look at the breakdown. Fourth graders remain virtually the same as last year with 43% proficient. Eighth graders improve by 3% to 25% proficient. And 11th graders jump five points to 26% proficient. We also, as a state, have been working to build curriculum in science, and we've had teachers and principals and uh, other school leaders across the state over a number of years working to create um, curriculum to provide the tools and supports for our teachers in our classrooms. Students at East Greenwich High School scored the highest in Rhode Island. The Reservoir Avenue School in Providence, East Providence, and Westerly School Districts also showed significant gains. Still, the Education Commissioner says the results reveal persistent achievement gaps for minorities students. And so while we're, we want to lift up performance for every student, we also want to make sure uh, that our students from those different groups are, are also achieving at even more accelerated rates so we can try to close those achievement gaps. For a complete breakdown of Rhode Island's NECAP science test scores, log on to our website, WPRI.com. In Bristol, with the East Bay Mobile Newsroom, I'm Stephen Schuler, Eyewitness News.